Hello boys and girls and welcome to my channel, I'm the General of Rome and today we're back playing some more European Settlers for the Riches and for the Tudomat as Byzantium. Where uh, we just peace out of a war against Wallachia. And Wallachia already aren't... Uh, I mean, wait, this is Wallachian peasants and why are you sieging it? I don't know. Do I want to know? Probably not. But I'm gonna kill them. Also, apparently when we die today, we get a succession war. Which means that we probably should stay at war for a long time. Just, the big question is, who can we declare on? Like, does my... Yes, Croatia does have any... Does have some, uh, some stuff over here in, uh, in Bosnia. Do we still have a truce with this guy? No, we don't. But he does have good allies. I don't have any claims anymore over here. I'm, I do still have a truce over here. I could go to war with Room again. That means fighting the Mormooks again. And maybe the Indurates. I probably should wait till the Indurates peace out here. Otherwise he will have access. Yeah, it's probably not a good idea. So, let's just for now uh, go and fabricate a claim up here. So we have the possibility to declare on this guy. I mean, I think it's better to declare on this guy than to declare on Bosnia. Yeah, definitely. Oh, never mind, I already sent him. Seriously? I already sent him for this province, alright. Oh, yes. Oh, the rebels just disappeared. Now, I don't want this guy, these guys to get stuck here. So I may just go and... Sneak around through this land like that, and then uh, I don't know where are you going. Um, you probably can go to uh, to Athens. I'll send this guy around over here. Then you can go to, well, you go to Athens and then you can go to Constantinople. Makes sense. And these guys are going over here to uh, get rid of the rebels, so I probably should move my general back in there. I got the general over here because I wanted to fight the rebels. But apparently they just disappeared, and I guess it makes sense, because they weren't the right rebels. They were Moldavian peasants, and... Or, uh, no, it were well, large and peasants, and this is Levy, of course. So, did we get a big coalition for this? Nope. Nobody cared about me taking lots of land over here, apparently. It is like a long time ago since I recorded anything. Thank you, game. More rebels. Could of course go for uh, for Venice. Never mind, Venice is allied to uh, to France, so I can't kill him. We may need to go and improve relations with Chernogov again. Keep him happy. Right. 
part, we killed the enemy in uh, roads. Move on over here. Plus Aragon is in the PU with uh, Castile, which is highly unfortunate. got discovered. That's no good. Do we maybe want to build some more ships? We may want to build some more ships. And we only have 38 and we have a force limit of 75. We can't really afford to have so much stuff, but we can make some. Um, where is our navy? Over here in Constantinople. Um, yeah, let's get some more, uh, some more stuff. In this case, stuff means transports. And maybe also some more galleys. Probably. Should be enough for now. Let's kill. Come on. Come on. Don't take too much losses. That's terribly loud. Alright, come back to Trebizond. Or oh, wherever throws on this, over here. It's not going that quickly. I'm just really scared about falling into that personal union. If we get into a personal union with France. As the lesser partner in the Union, then it's just all over. We can't win a war against France. What's our mission? To claim for you. Oh, this works too. Get into another war. France is eating some more of the HRE, I guess. Yes, it is. Um, conquest of Arnauts, probably. French conquest of Brabant, yeah, that is Arnauts. Yeah, sure, I will accept. I'm not gonna do anything, but I will accept. Of course, if I die today, can't get into the PU. Should just get his dynasty, I think. Yes. God damn it, rebels. More and more rebels. Get rid of the general over here and send him over here. To go crush him. Or should be fine here. Yeah. So I may want to start shipping troops over to uh, to northern Italy. Of course, most of the fights are going to be in Italy. I mean, there are six thousand troops here, so. Um, I do. We'll get this one over here too. Should have let him stay there. And this one will sell to the will be sent to the islands over here. Then we'll pick him up. It's, these ones can roll over to Constantinople, I guess.
Croatia, you're gonna lose rebels, so I need to go fight more rebels. Fess, you are now at the same side in the war. Good job, you are helping my vassal. It's highly appreciated. I think Bosnia, Bosnia is Western, isn't he? No, he isn't. Alright. Oh, some more Jeu de Pomme. It's been a while since I've played Jeu de Pomme in this uh, game. Maybe not in episodes, but it has been a long time. Again, it is like a few weeks ago since I last recorded something for this. Because I don't like it as much anymore as I liked it earlier. It's just going so slow. Game is so slow and uh, you can't take much land because insane aggressive expansion. So we are right in. Naples for the jeu de pomme, but not yet for the troops. It's gonna be really nice when we are playing a jeu de pomme match while being at war with them. It's like, yay, we're best buds, but we're at war at the same time, yay! Um. After like 70 or so episodes, I still can't really do Jeu de Bomb. It's just really dumb. Oh no, I didn't want this guy. I wanted this guy to stay here. I wanted this guy. I shouldn't do admin points. I already don't have too much admin points. And I lost again. God damn it. Stupid show the bomb. I hate show the bomb in this game. No show the bomb for me in a while. Yeah, I guess that. This is gonna flip to France. Although France is my ally, I don't like it that things are flipping to France. Also, I don't like it that we can't convert any lands to our, uh, to our culture. At least we accept Turkish. Except anything else. Let's have a look. Um, where it is? Yeah, yeah, we accept Bulgarian too. Good, I guess. But we don't accept any of the lands over here, and of course the one over there. Is this Tartar or? Yeah, it's Tartar. All right then. Ships and go. Some more ships are finishing. God damn it, now he does have. Uh, Thanks. He now does have rebels. Right, let's get the ships together. Send them to the island. To get these guys over here too. 
take four young. Oh, I think that will happen. Let's see here for the national statistics. We have two highly unstable provinces. Wow. This one, of course. And which one? It's one of those. This one. Can I sell that to, uh, to this guy, maybe? No, I can't because I'm a boy. Yeah, that's a problem. And then back over here, because we will have to go and pick up the guys to go and kill these rebels. All right. Well, let's bring these guys over to here, I guess. You still don't have enough transports. Well, let's wait for the other ones to arrive here. Yeah? That should work. Yes, it will. Right. As long as he doesn't get any bullshit, idiotly good allies. We should be fine. Right, let's get the general over here. Because these guys are all western, so they are, they are gonna be hard to fight. So I guess I could get a second claim. But if he didn't claim anything. Oh yeah, because... Guess what? It's 1.7, so vassals don't claim shit. Yeah, Salermo. Let's go for it. Probably won't take it, because too much AE, but... Uh... Won't hurt to get some... Uh... Some what's it called? Some claims. Oh, great. Base tax growth. We have access over here, but I'm not gonna waste my diplomat on that, because it will automatically get uh, cancelled when uh, he joins the war against me. At least I think so. Oh, my advisor died. Now, a force to have both advisors, I think so. National revolt risk goes down, that's a really good one. Minus 3 revolt risk, that's really powerful for a level 1 advisor. Reinforced speed is not great, but oh well. I do want the points. Um, how much... Uh, things do I have? I have 15 cannons. I guess it's worth it to go for it. It's actually a really good one here. Mauritian infantry, and yet it won't give me any infantry. Instead, will give us uh, cannons. I guess it's because I'm not Western. Bombards. Great. on the ships, and go. We'll wait till this guy arrives, and then we'll declare. But from Bosnia we'll take this province, because uh, my vessel has a claim on it. So why the hell not? Oh, 
How long till we arrive? Only a few days. Six more days. Come on. Right. Naples, you, sir, are going down. France won't join. Because he is in another war. Chernogov because it's a distant war. We should be fine. Let me check how much troops Naples has again. Should still have a decent amount, but probably not too much. Naples has 18 guys, that's actually a lot. I didn't expect him to have so much troops. Alright then, we may wait till uh so I can use the troops over here too. So, get another leader. Give me a 6-5, or whatever it was. No, that wasn't a 6-5. It was a 2-6. Uh, no, a 2-5, alright. We have a 5-3 and a 4-5, uh, alright. Be nice if someone else declared on Naples. Like the Pope, maybe? Pope already is at war. You're serious, the Pope is inside the HRE. God damn it. It's like really awful. Because at some point I do want to take Rome, of course, and that means fighting the Emperor. Which probably is the Platinum at this point. Yes. Only one guy is voting for Austria and one guy for uh, Brunswick. Denmark and Norway are just, and Novgorod are just eating Sweden. Poor, poor Sweden. Sabir and the Turkish Gagnite want access. Um, where is it? Turkish Cagnites. Um, do I even know about you? Should be somewhere over here, but I'm not seeing it. Where are you guys? You are here. Are you one problem minor? That's so sad. Yeah, sure, you want access for uh, Crimea. Sibir too. I don't care about that. Won the fight, go back. I sort of do want to annex Moldavia, but on the other hand, I do also need him to feed more land over here. To get rid of my uh, provinces that will give me... Uh, what's it called again? Highly unstable. Right, go here. So I guess there's really just no point for Emerity to stay, so... When we are at peace again, we will get rid of Emerity. But the problem is, we are not gonna be at peace for a long while. Of course, I will just stay in this war as long as possible. If I don't get call for peace, I will just stay in the war till my king dies. Oh, 
who owns Arag who owns the Balias? The Order of Saint John from all people spawned over here. Well but I didn't get a core on it and I probably can't core it. I don't even have a core over here anymore. Well Force accepted peace at Holstein. Holstein will concede defeat. Chernigov has rubble problems, but they are taking care of it. Good job, Chernigov. Yeah, Autodox is doing pretty good, apart from in this area. But if you, uh, if you know how big the Golden Horde was, then you can say that they are doing pretty good right now. Golden Horde is still around, but that's it. They lost all their eastern lands. I still have some land over here. They're getting wrecked by Georgia and some other guys. Plum, how are you losing this fight? Oh great, more rebels in Rhodes. And my guys already arrived, so I guess I will send them back to Rhodes. Thank you game. Not really. Although our missionaries report that the people of Rhodes have converted to Orthodox, it appears that their efforts were less successful than started. And stated. I can read. The fuck is Aiken, Aiken and uh, Yor Yoruba? Never heard of those religions. Aiken still has a, uh, a nation, but the other religion doesn't. This guy is not gonna live for long, probably. What looks like he has these three promises for a long time, so he may. Stay uh, with, stay alive for a long time. Probably not though. All my guys die yet? Yes, they are. Right. Fight rebels, Catholic cells that want to flip to the papal state. Yay! Right. On the boat. I said, get on the boat. And back again. So hopefully not more rebels will spawn. You're kidding me, right? <laughs> hopefully no more rebels will spawn. At the same moment we get rebels. Well, five more, I guess. I got lucky with the amount of rebels. I saw 23 as a possibility at the moment I clicked it. So if we got the 23 rebels, we would have had a big problem here. Yeah? Right, on the boat. Give it another try. Please no more rebels. Have mercy, please. I mean, I guess we could wait till France speaks out of this war, so he may join. We could actually see if he wants to join. Um, yeah, if he wasn't in that war, he would totally join. So I guess I can wait for a little bit.
isn't really progressing that quickly, unfortunately. I would like to see how the uh, how the new world looks like, if there are already some colonies going on. I mean, there are probably no colonial nations yet, but there will probably be some uh, some colonies. I mean, we already can see that Castile has colonies over here, and Portugal has one over here, but Portugal has not. Yeah, it's gone over here. Also, there's so much less provinces over here. Oh, great stability increase. Good, good. <laughs> We're gonna lose it like right away when our king dies. Is our king a general? No, he isn't. Good. Otherwise, we'll lose two stability. And we're at war. On France, don't be so silly. Hurry up. Oh, this is gonna be silly again. Where France can't siege this progress, be siege this province because uh, friendly rebels are sieging it. You had the same problem. Where was it again? Here, I believe. In one of the earliest episodes. Or against Genoa, was that? Genoa now, of course, is really silly. I think he's only a one cross minor. Yes, he is. He does have. He does still have some cores over here and on the islands and here on my island. I'm sort of looking forward to seeing what happens when the reformation bre breaches out. See what flips. Of course, there isn't yet the uh, 30 years war mechanic, so the league wars can't happen. Grenada still exists as a silly two prongs minor. The only reason why they exist is that Portugal keeps sieging this when Castile declares war on them. So Castile can't, can't get it because uh, Portugal sieges it. It's so silly. No one is gonna help that poor army of Venice. Oh, right, it's our Venetians, so they aren't poor. Never mind. It was what you deserved. But I am out of time for this episode, so hope you enjoyed this episode, and see you next time.